we shall now study how to use link with actual database rather than with the collection as we have been doing in the past. So for this let us first of all uh, draw it, uh, get a database made and uh, then we will uh, demonstrate how we can connect to the database from the very basic steps that is without the taking any help of the designer we'll be demonstrating like from the very fundamentals although in real practice you don't use that but that will help you clarify some of the concepts so uh, let me now move on to creating a database so follow these steps here is an app data. you should have created a basic uh, MBC application and now we'll click on the app underscore data folder add new item and instead of SQL Server Compact we can do the fuller version also because we haven't done so far so we can write SQL Server database and we can give it any name I am giving it DB users so my general trend is to always start the name of database with the DB and click add so after a while you'll find dbusers.mdf under app underscore data and since it is under app underscore data we'll be easily seeing it underscore database explorer and here we can click the database appears here the connection is closed by default because of this red cross and you can see then we can click it to open and there is nothing under tables uh, you can have stored procedures and everything that's empty basically let us now add one table right click on tables and click add new table after a long time this one appears the pane you see here is T SQL that is it actually represents the SQL equivalent of the diagram you are seeing here so here we are seeing the SQL equivalent create table dbo dot table the name of the table is table this care bracket can be used to store names of your tables but this care bracket is required in two cases compulsorily you, you are welcome to store your table name as tbl name here like this no issues but even if you don't do in this case it will work because there are no gaps but if you are giving a name in which gaps are there then you must use these care brackets one one case the other case is when you are going to use a uh, name that is same as a keyword so if I see the uh, uh, scene below table is actually a keyword so it has been put inside this the name of the table will be table but it's absurd we'll immediately change it so don't forget to change this in your case so we'll we can change it here this is the only place where you can change I am giving it TBL users so you must change this first and now let us come this is ID I'll change it to email and here I can choose n where care just creating a table n where care 50 and uh, this is primary key but I can right click it to remove primary key and if it is not there to set primary key the trick is to right click and then the next time writing name this also I am quickly putting n where care 50 and uh, allow nulls is we don't allow nulls no default is set so we are creating a simple table for a demonstration purposes now how to uh, store this table to a database this is our database this table doesn't appear here until we go and click this update this update will be available just above this click on this and this story appears and then we can click update database and now to see we can refresh this refresh and your table appears here 